Yo, what's going on everybody? This is Cleveland Pan Flamingo Power Wash. Back with a brand new video for you guys. Today we're working in Tampa, Florida, in New Tampa. Actually, uh, we're here for a, um, a roof cleaning uh, for a customer here. And I don't know, man. I don't know if y'all know Dominique Rogers Camardi from the NFL. This is his house here. We're doing the roof. Shout out to my boy Malcolm that gave me the lead. Um, I got a trainee with me here. He flew in from uh, South Carolina. His name is Eric. So we're gonna be tackling a couple of jobs today. Today we're doing this first roof cleaning and then and, uh, we got another job on the schedule. So let me show you guys what we got going on. All right, so this is the house here. As you can tell, there's a lot of algae on that roof. Two-story home. We got a lot of plants around, so we're gonna go ahead and um, water everything down. I got my man Eric here from South Carolina. Yes, sir, yes, Full sir. court, pressure washing. Yes, sir. My man came down to learn, you know, get some hands-on experience with me. This house here is uh, right on a little lake, a little canal right here. So, like I said, it's a lot of trees, not trees, but bushes. We're going to water them down, soak them up before we start just to protect everything. The tile roof probably hasn't been clean in a while, so we're going to probably be using a, a 5% maybe even a 6% on there, just to make sure we um, don't have to come back and hit anything twice. I don't know if you guys can see how bad it is up there, but I'm gonna show you guys when I get up there. Hey, if y'all haven't yet, man, make sure y'all hit, hit the subscribe button, uh, comment below, you know what I'm saying, like the video, just help me get some more views on YouTube. Uh, appreciate all my subscribers, man, so. I'm gonna get up there and show you guys the view from up top. All right, guys, this is the top. Oh, wee! This, the, this gotta be the worst one I'm probably gonna do, man. This thing is cooked on, man. Look how dark this thing looks. Wow, look at that. Mm-mm-mm. No sorry. This thing is dirty. We're gonna start spraying the back area first because there's no plants back there. There's plants on the other uh each side of the house and also the front. So I'm gonna start spraying back here. I got my mask on so I can't talk for long. Let me get some pictures. I got a leak in my gun, man. It cracked. It cracked right there. So I can't fix it today. So we're gonna have to do the way it is. back coated still got to get all this area that's dirty that side and this side here this area looks dirty as heck over here man too dirty
I just bumped my mix up to 6%. It's reacting much better with the algae. I was spraying the fires earlier. I might have to go back and hit this areas again, but I can tell the six is reacting pretty good. Right away. No, you don't have to rinse the roof unless you want to. It's not required that you rinse the roof. It's a preference thing. That's cool. If you want to, that's fine. If you don't, that's fine. No issue with that. Alright guys, all done with the roof here. As you can tell, everything looks spectacular, man. That algae melted like butter. Looking good. Just waiting for a good rain to come, give it a good rinse. And we're good to go, man. Ugh. Took a little while, man, with my gun leaking, but no, we got it done. Still got it done, so. Everything's looking good though. I went 6% on this because it was so bad. And I don't want to be up here spraying two, three times. So everything's looking good. We're going to pack it up, head up to the next job. All right, we're all set up right here with the second job right now. We're in Lando Lakes, Florida. We're here to do this patio cleaning, screen and patio. Uh, house is going up for sale. so. They just want to get it cleaned up it has a lot of algae so uh, we're gonna hit it with a you know what i'm saying with a decent mix just to melt the algae and then we're gonna surface clean it i'm gonna let eric jump on this get some hands on on that and uh you know it'll be the last job for the day man so this is the deck here see in between the cracks it's algae all throughout right there Pretty dirty, man. We're gonna use the big boy. We're gonna do the big boy right here. Since Eric, Eric wanna use the uh, Respucia over here. He wanna use Respucia, so we're gonna pull the big boy out, or big girl out, I should say. <laughs> Get that cleaned up, man. We're gonna 
downstream our mix on here, just loosen up the algae. So the back is all done. Eric is knocking out the, this little section of the driveway, the concrete part, and the sidewalk for the customer. A little add-on, man, 50 bucks. Buy, din buy dinner tonight. <laughs> you see that, man? That 20 inch, he got tired of that, that, that big Respucia. He got tired of Respucia, so he got the little 20 inch now. done with the job Eric knocked out the driveway here everything's looking nice let's check the back out I might be coming back man a customer asked me for a house wash house isn't even that bad that bad but like I said it's going up for sale so he said he's gonna see what the realtor says but if he does that's a five hundred dollar house wash so you know so and it's gonna be a nice ticket check out the deck all cleaning up, drying up nicely over here. All the algae is gone. Yes, sir. Decent day, man. It's 5.30. We started like, like 12 o'clock. I think we started. We had to do some errands this morning, man. My first, my van died. My battery, my battery and my van died twice i had to get a new battery then the second job i mean the first job as you guys see my gun was leaking so that was a wreck and um oh yeah man i got sh burn all in my hands man so 
you got to make sure you get some good gloves man i had some uh, gloves that was vinyl in the front but cotton or whatever in the back get you some latex gloves man so you can protect your hands Derek, man it's a good job today bro appreciate that man. my man came all the way from greenville uh orangeburg orangeburg, orangeburg south kakilaki yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah man my man happy came birthday. down happy birthday oh yeah birthday boy over here down in florida he hitting two birds with one stone, man. Getting the training and birthday, man. So, as I told you guys, man, I got SH burn on my knuckles from the gloves. So, if you do not have one in your rig, make sure you get a first aid kick. You know what I'm saying? I was lucky to have this. You know what I'm saying? Get some burn cream on here, you know what I'm saying? Just to protect it. But I uh, appreciate y'all checking the videos out. I'm going to catch y'all the next one. Peace.